Hey racers, John Racer3 here today back for another video. Today is sort of the part two ish of the Matchbox convention whole thing. I'm going to be going over so all of the cars, everything that I bought and received at the Matchbox convention in this video. And there are a whole bunch of cars. So I'm going to try and stretch this to 10 minutes and show you guys what we have. So we have some Hot Wheels over here, which I will end with i think i'm going to start off with the cars over here we've got a whole bunch of different brands actually over here to start off with we have the aldar 58 design mercedes-benz 6x6 this was a very exclusive paint as you can see it's only one out of 200 from michael Heralda. uh very cool matchbox designer got his own custom box picked up two of these actually and they look super super good pretty rare very happy to have those in the collection they look super good now i bought a lot of tomicas we don't get tomicas here in the united states so i just decided it would be cool to invest and spend some money on some tomicas so i got a pack of four ferraris tomica actually just recently got the ferrari license which is pretty cool as you can see it's got the official Ferrari stuff there. We got four Ferraris. We got a yellow La Ferrari, a 488 Spider, just regular 488, and a La Ferrari Spider, all in some unique colors. And then I just got some main ones. We got a 488 GTB in red. We got an Enzo Ferrari in red. And then we also got the Ferrari La Ferrari scale 162. Cannot wait to open this baby up and put it on the track. It will be very exciting to see that open. But then we got this. This is a Nissan GTR Nismo GT500. This is a like GTLM version of the Nissan GTR, which I'm super excited to have because as you guys know, I love my GT cars. So this is a Nissan GTR that's going to be competing against the other GT cars that I have in my collection. So there, there, there you have that. That's a really cool looking paint on it as well. Cannot wait to open Tomikas. As usual, Tomikas are absolutely amazing. Next up, we've got a Mystery Models Chase, as you can see, guys see here, but it is definitely, for sure, 100%, see if we could focus here, the Super Trofeo from Lamborghini. I believe it's gold. I'll have to unbox it in a new tournament coming up here, but that is another GTR, or GT car, just like the GTR. Uh, hopefully race those two against each other. That would be super cool. Next up, we've got some Johnny Lightning cars. I don't have many Johnny Lightning in my collection, but we've got two beautiful Golf cars. We've got a Ford Mustang Boss 302 and a Ford GT, both in a Golf livery. Two of my probably all-time favorite Fords. So you got those in beautiful Golf racing liveries. I don't know if they're fast or not. I'll probably unbox them for my next tournament, but there. There are some very cool cars. Now we're gonna start getting into the Hot Wheels stuff. This I already talked about in my vlog, but it is a pre-production model of the Audi RS, or not the Audi RS, the Audi R8 GTLM car. This thing is very cool. I call it the Spider-Man car. As you can see, it has the numbers on the top. This thing looks absolutely amazing. I love pre-production models of GT cars. Definitely be putting that on a just on my display here at some point, but that's probably the biggest thing that I bought at the convention and it's absolutely beautiful. 100% love the purchase. So next up, we got some normal Hot Wheels cars. We got a Mazda RX-7 Zamac. I'm never really able to find Zamacs where I live, so I was able to pick up some of these for a great price and some of them are really good looking like this McLaren P1. You got some orange on there with a silver and a black stripe. This thing looks so good. I love the wheels on it. I think now that I have this, I own every single McLaren P1 that as Hot Wheels has ever made, which is some really cool stuff. And uh, the P1's a really nice casting. I very, very much enjoy the P1. Next up, we've got a Nissan Skyline GTR Zamac. I love, I picked up this car mainly for one reason. One, it's from like the golden era Hot Wheels, as you can see. I don't remember what year it is, 2013. And the wheels on this thing, looks so good on this GTR. I think these are some of my favorite wheels Hot Wheels has ever made. It's one of those wheels where the paint comes off super easily when it races, but this GTR is one of those cars. It just looks so good. I am very happy to have it. And then we have, of course, the Dodge Challenger SRT Demon Zamac. 
which is very cool looking. I don't know, I just sort of picked up some of the Zamax from some of my favorite castings, such as the RX-7, probably one of my favorite Hot Wheels castings ever. Glad to have that as a Zamax. So, they are... Attention all collectors, if you want a chance to win a $50 Target gift card, all you gotta do is to go into the description of the video you're watching right now and click the link and fill out a short little survey that Matchbox want you guys to fill out. The Matchbox team wants you to learn more about you guys, so they'll listen to everything you have to say in the survey, and it's actually pretty fun to fill out. Uh, one entry is one email so you can enter multiple times and I would greatly appreciate it. Let me know down in the comments when you fill out the survey and I'll give you a shout out at the end of the video. This survey is, as again, as I said earlier, super easy to fill out. It asks you questions about your collection and what you like to collect so it's super fun to just look back and see what your answers are so go ahead fill out the survey in the description i would greatly appreciate it and so would matchbox and i'll see you guys back in video those so, next up we've got a lamborghini reventon roadster along with the zamax i'm i have a very hard time finding the red series as well so we have a red edition lamborghini reventon here looking very beautiful with those gray wheels red body and white stripes that is very nice to pick up. They were handing out free Fiat's at one of the rooms, so I just managed to get a free Fiat 500, which is awesome. Glad to have in the collection. Definitely already have several of the, those, but they was free, so can you blame me? Anyway, next up we got another red edition. We got an SRT Viper GTSR in red. This is probably one of my favorite paints that the Viper has come out in, personally. This paint looks so good. I like it a lot. And then next up, we've got another Zamac, the Porsche 911 GT3 RS, another one of my favorite Hot Wheels castings in Zamac form. I really don't like how they have silver wheels along with the Zamac body. Don't think it looks that great, but I picked it up for the collection because I don't have it yet, and I really like casting. Next up, we've got a Corvette ZR1, and this is from Matchbox. It's a paint that I, it really, really caught my eye. It looks super good. I love the paint on the thing, the red and white and everything, the base of it being white. It looks like it was just driven out of the snow. It looks super cool, so I picked it up. And then we also have some Matchbox models that I was not able to find. Believe it or not, the BMW i8, I was not able to find this thing, but it looks great in black. Matchbox did a great job with it. Then we also got a Hudson Hornet there in blue from with a police police scheme but then was one of those cars that just looks too cool not to pick up so i went ahead and picked it up anyway this is probably one of the biggest steals of the entire convention it has that super nationals 10th anniversary anniversary albuquerque new mexico's like sticker on it. it's not really a sticker it's like in the car definitely going to keep this thing carded but it's a bugatti veyron very hard to find and this thing it's got to make it rare at, of some some sort right so that's very nice glad to have that in the collection tuned enzo again one of those cars that i just love so much i wanted to have one carded got a ferrari there looking beautiful and then another red edition the porsche 918 spider looking good next up we've got the lotus exige in red i like it love the lotus exige nice little casting there this is the matchbox super lifted truck this is actually a real truck in real life that matchbox brings to the convention every year so i just thought hey i think it's about time to add one of those to the collection i'll buy a premium more premium one i think in, an, in the upcoming years but we got a just basic model there i love the look of it looks good and speaking of loving the look of it we've got the mustang mach 1 in green with those goodyear tires hot wheels classics and oh my gosh this thing looks good I picked it up and I could not put it down. Very nice casting to have there. Next up, we've got a pair of treasure hunts here. We got the uh, rubber wheeled version of it and then we got the regular version of this T-Hunt. This thing looks super, super good, 32 forward. Cannot wait to unbox them and just put them next to each other. Cause those things, those things will look good next to each other for sure. Next up, we've got the Hot Wheels Rally series. Again, I was not able to find this series either. I only have half because Hot Wheels tournaments have the other half and we split it, but I got the Escort and the Focus, which were really the main cars that I wanted from the series. So I'm glad to have those. And now we get to the juicy stuff. I know you guys love to see Super Treasure Hunt. So we got an Audi RS6 Avant Super Treasure Hunt with the factory sealed set on the front. 
very nice definitely going to open it because this casting is too beautiful to be kept in its package that looks super good i actually found these at a target close to the convention we got some mario kart cars definitely want to make a mario kart video here at some point so i'll make sure to do that we got some uh, other just miscellaneous stuff we got an interstate batteries 18 car this is probably one of the coolest pieces this is a special hot wheels for like holding uh supercar in a little pedestal there and it looks super good if you couldn't tell what the sponsor was on that it's actually hot wheels so that's very cool and then we found some superstar transporters hot wheels tournaments gave this to me it is a nascar hauler this is just says good year racing looks super clean glad to have that in the collection next up we've got the rest of the super treasure hunts that i copped we have the ford escort rs 1600 one of my favorite castings in hot wheels as super treasure hunt that's pretty cool then we have the Corvette Grand Sport Roadster. I love the price, or not the price, I love the look on this thing as well in gold with the Goodyear tires. Very nice to have. We've got the Lamborghini Aventador J that just came out super recently, super treasure hunt. Glad to find that. And then the Lamborghini Mira Homage or the Lamborghini Aventador Super here as well. Glad to have that in the collection as well. So now we got both of the Lamborghini Supers. Glad to have both of those. And then we have some supercars. We got the Ferrari 458 Spider in blue. We've got, let's see here, the Chevy Chevelle SS. This matches sort of the super treasure hunt that came out a while ago that I already have. So I caved in and bought that. We have an Aston Martin 177 in white. Ferrari 458 Italian white. And then a 599XX. Uh, both of these cars I already have, but I'm, I just wanted to see them packaged because this this thing for sure is one of my favorite cars of all time. So I'm glad to have this here. And then we just got some oldies. We got a Maserati MC12 faster than ever. We've got some stock cars, old BMW Roadster, and then a two pack with another stock car and a funny car. So other than that, I got some Lucy cars. We got a major at Ferrari here and then two NASCAR Lucy cars. So, uh, yeah, other than that, that is pretty much my entire haul from the Matchbox convention. I'm going to be doing a lot of videos with these cars in the future. Hope you enjoy, and comment down below what car you want me to open, especially the Super Treasure Hunts, because I need to open some, because I'm running out of room on my Super Treasure Hunt haul wall. So, tell me which cars to open, and I'll make sure to try and do it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.